here. Welcome back to day three of our 10 day ab finisher challenge. As you see today, we're going to be doing our exercise on the floor with my favorite mat, half inch foam. If you guys want an um, exercise mat, I always put the link below. You guys have the PDF, you have the diagram showing the exercise, but if you're joining me, you can check out the form for the exercise and I'll show you guys modifiers as needed. All right, we're going to be doing 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. I just do one set of the exercises to show you guys the exercise and then you can rewind this and play it two to three times. Um, so yeah, we're going to start with our Russian twist. And with some of these exercises, I do not have a weight, but you can also add a weight to make it more advanced if you like. Um, like I said, we're going to start with Russian twist, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. And I need to get my timer. So... Yes, you guys, I just use an old phone as a timer. Nothing fancy. Nope. So, all right, I'm going to show you Russian twist. It's one of my favorite core ab exercises. What you're going to do, you're sitting, hips 90, knees bent, ankles bent, toes pointing up. And it's going to alternate side to side like this. All right, we're going to do 20 seconds. Go at your own pace. Here we go. 20 seconds. Russian twist. Keep that core tucked in. As always, I always say focus on form, not speed. Because if you don't have the right form, you could get hurt or it could be doing nothing for you. Right? So core tucked in, almost there. High five. Always give you guys high fives. Exercise one is done. Our next one is going to be plank rockers. Right? So make sure you guys can see me. All right, you're going to be on your elbows for this one, all right? Your feet, um, not shoulder width apart, but not right next to you, not like close together, a little separated, all right? And with plank rockers, what you're going to do, you're going to be on your elbows, and you're going to lean back through your heels, press those heels back, and then come forward through your toes, lean back through your heels, forward in your toes. All right, so that's going to be plank rocker. I mean, another way you can do this to modify would be high plank like this, back and forth, and that's another way you can do it. I try to think of modifiers for every exercise. All right, you guys? So, if you're ready, we're going to do 20 seconds of plank rockers. You guys are ready? Here we go. Back through your heels, through your toes, back, forward. Core tucked in, back flat. You're going to be looking down as well. Go at your own pace. exercises done halfway there so next we're going to do our twisted climbers all right you guys um with this one you can use a mat if you want to i'm not going to i mean you can put your hands here you don't really need the support for your feet but you can put your hands here if you want some extra support so with twisted climbers it's like a mountain climber but you're going to bring your leg across so you know mountain climbers like this the um, twisted climbers are going to go cross cross like this just like that. Okay, you can modify by stepping it across. All right, I'm gonna go a little bit faster, but you can step it if you need to as well. And I always say with modifications, you can start by doing it the way I'm doing it, and then you can go to modification and go back to the way I'm doing it. You can modify it the whole time. Really, whatever works for you. All right, so we're gonna do 20 seconds of twisted climbers. If you guys are ready, here we go. Core tucked in. Back flat, hands under your shoulders. Halfway done, less than 10 seconds left. Whew. High five, high five. One more exercise, we're gonna do um, plank leg lifts. So let me show you this. High plank, all right? So what you're gonna do, put your feet together, high plank, hands under your shoulders, core tucked in, back flat. We're just gonna lift one leg up, bring it down, one leg up, bring it down. So squeeze that glute, those glutes back down, squeeze the glutes back down, all right? And if you want to, another way you can do this, I try to, like I say, I always think of modifications for people that you can keep one leg down if you want, go like this, if you want. That's another way that you can do it. I try to modify, like I said, planks, you can always say you can do them on your knees. So that's another way you can do it, all right? If you guys are ready, we're gonna alternate sides with the plank leg lifts. Instead of doing just one side, we're gonna alternate back and forth. 20 seconds, last exercise. Here we go. 
core tucked in, back flat, hands under your shoulders. I will always repeat, focus on form. I know you guys may get tired of me saying that, but it's so important. If I'm going too fast, go at your own pace. That's it, you guys. Four exercises. So what you can do, you can rewind this, play it again two or three times. Um, like I said, some of the exercises you can add weight as well. Later on, I will show you guys some of those as well. But for now, just using your body weight. And if you don't have a mat, like I said, check this out. Link is in the um, is underneath. Also, comment what you think about the workout so far. I know it's only day three, but any questions you have, any comments, you have a meal plan with it as well. Let me know how that's going. Um, yeah, that's day three. I will see you tomorrow and have a great day. Bye.